As we know, Instagram's marketing trends are constantly changing and the demands of Instagram are ever changing with what the audience wants and what the audience needs. Instagram is something that has been stuck around with us since around maybe even like 2011 and has continued strong, but also Marketing on Instagram has changed drastically and that is the conversation that we do want to have today. Instagram is changing, the platform is changing, and you want to make sure that with your business, with your product, your service, your platform, you know, your online persona, if you're an influencer, is making sure that you are staying on those trends and making sure that you are up to date with those different changes happening on Instagram. So of course, today we're going to be talking about five Instagram strategies and tips for 2022. So again, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe so that you can stay updated on all of our videos and make sure that you do check out all of our other social media platforms such as YouTube, Instagram, TikTok, and many more. So of course, let's dive right on in. Number one would be the urge of raw videos. And I'm not talking about the file type, I'm talking about the content within your videos, within your post and everything like that. As a society, it seems that we've moved more towards natural, more towards what's really going on and being transparent with your audience. And I'm, and I'm not talking about, you know, not wearing makeup or not doing your hair. I'm doing about being honest with your audience about who you are and, and what you want out of the platform. When you're honest with your audience, it just seems that they're able to better connect with you. And when you're passionate about it and you really let that passion shine through, your audience will see that they'll be just as excited about what you want to put out on the internet. When you're being raw, when you're being real, and when you truly are being yourself, people gravitate towards that and they don't want to see, you know, such calculated robotic videos and kind of content that they already expect for you to want and for you to see. You want to make sure that you're putting out content that truly speaks to who they are as a person and speaks to who they are as a character. So just making sure that you really truly are honing in on that and being yourself and just having fun. The next thing would be to merge video formats and to also repurpose content. There's so many different platforms and there's so many different trends coming in and out of Instagram that you wanna make sure that by merging those other video platforms that you're present on really is something that you put at the top of your to-do list because once your Instagram followers know that you have TikTok, know that you have Pinterest, know that you have LinkedIn or you know whichever platform you use, they'll be like, wow, well, let me follow you on Instagram so I can see more of your content. And essentially doing this will boost your audience in all different aspects, will boost your audience in many different angles, and will really bring in those kind of people that your content is made for. And then of course, the repurposing content aspect is so important and goes hand in hand with the, you know, merging the video formats because once you make one form of an original content, let's say for YouTube, you can cut that video up and, you know, put it into a 15 second TikTok teaser video or put it on the Instagram story or make it an IGTV live as a trailer. When you're showing different sides of your content by only utilizing one piece of content that you make a week will not only save time, but will also show your different platforms that you are building that hype for that next video that you're trying to release and that next form of content that you're putting out on these different platforms. So again, making sure that you're repurposing the content, making sure that you are, you know, merging the video formats will really ensure that your marketing strategies are up to par with this new audience and with the ever-changing different aspects that come with Instagram marketing strategies and tactics. 
So the number three really goes back to number one and it kind of goes hand in hand is the brand's personality. Again, making sure that your kind of vibe, your kind of tone is super clear within your audience because it'll really help efficiently communicate the kind of vibe you're trying to speak for your brand and your business and your product or service. I mean, at the end of the day, when you truly know exactly what you want when it comes to you know the audience that you're trying to build and you know the kind of persona that you're trying to show your audience once you have your brand personality down it'll be a lot easier for people to connect with your content and for your audience to find you and to find exactly the kind of videos you put out because your personality and because your niche would be so clear in what you're trying to accomplish so again just making sure that everything that you are putting out is clear and concise and really does speak volume of to who you are and the kind of content you're trying to promote to the media so of course making sure that brand personality is super clear and super visually understood so the next thing would be video memes and humor at the end of the day people want to laugh and people are going to send things to other people that make them laugh and especially with reels as we've seen tiktok you know instagram taking on that tiktok vibe with the instagram reels i don't know how many times i've sent my friends and the people that i love reels of funny dog videos like at the end of the day those are the things that i'm sending out to other people because i find funny and i find something that i know that they'll enjoy and they'll take a good laugh at so making sure that you are tapping into that humor and you are tapping into that fun side of yourself will really show your audience that you can have fun, you can have a good time, and you can also just find some humor in all the seriousness that social media marketing sometimes, you know, pursues. So showing your audience that you can have a laugh and that you can enjoy yourself will really help them, you know, want to come in and want to keep watching your videos. So the next thing would be using the engagement features. These engagement features, again, have you know circled back to the polls, to the questions, to all of the IGTVs, you know, doing features that your audience can interact with will ensure that they feel that they have a say in your business and your brand and, and that'll build the trust and the connection that you're looking for. But once you're able to let them interact with you, when you're able to let them experiment with you, and when you're able to just let them really in on the brand's, you know, questions and the brand's decisions, they'll feel that, wow, this brand really does listen to my voice and really does, you know, keep me updated on the very ever changing, um, you know, aspects of their brand. Again, this will solidify that relationship and will really ensure that they'll want to come back for more content and will want to keep returning to your page ever after and for many years to come. But of course, thank you so much for watching this video. I really hope that you can truly understand these new Instagram marketing tactics for 2022 because again, Instagram is constantly changing, trends are changing, different platforms are changing, and you wanna make sure that you're being up to date with the new changes and the new trends that come with a new year. But of course, thank you so much for watching. I hope that you like, comment, and subscribe and that you can keep updated on all of our tips and tricks and all of our upcoming videos that we do have planned for you. And again, I really hope that you can comment down below and you know, even show me some um, evidence or even you know, really just speak to your testimony of how this Instagram marketing strategy video really did help you know, plummet your growth or really increase your growth and really you know, expand that audience that you've been looking for. Of course, again, thank you so much for watching and have an amazing day.